Welcome to the WordPress course from beginner level to master's level. My name is Lamin Singate and in this course I'm going to help you to become a WordPress master. I know that there is many courses of WordPress, however I thought I will change the game a little bit. In this course we are going to do project of life project. We are going to build a WordPress site for a customer, but not just any customer. The customer will want so many features integrated on his WordPress site. I'm going to teach you how to set up your local environment, how to install WordPress and how to build the site from scratch. Please do not panic and don't worry, I will guide you through the whole way. In the meantime, let me show you at the end of the project what we try to achieve. So this is this is Squadron. This is the company that we are going to build a website for. And this is the website. Yes, I have already built this website. And yes, and but anyway, I am going to use this way. I'm going to rebuild this website with you step by step. Just take you through the website so I can show you the features that we that are in this website and that we are going to develop. You can see on the homepage there's a hero image, there's images, there is uh, loads of integrations and loads of JavaScripts on top of this. Um, in here we have some images, we have some carousels going, we have some side-by-side -side images, we have some videos integrated which you can play and watch, um, and we have a footer. We have lots of other pages as well, we have an overview page, and in this overview page is also filled with content. These contents are all, all demo content and epsilon It's just basically here to help us and guide us through. We have pilot leads, so it shows you the pilots that we have in on on site or you know. Again, this is all demo data. We have testimonial section as well. In this testimonial it shows um, you know what customers say, the experience, and it also has some carousels of customers going through. We have the tips and laws as well, which basically it's filled with content. We also have the drone license, where literally it explains, fills with content, and is with tabs, different kind of tabs, which goes from one one to another. We have service pages, and it's similar similar section, filled with content. And I'm going to jump to to few few interesting ones. We have blogs, and we have the different types of blogs as well, which basically you can click on a blog and this will open the content of the blog. In this blog you can comment and you can post, you can comment on a post. Same time we have the portfolio section as well. In this portfolio we have side by side images and content which basically we can then click individually to read through and know exactly what the portfolio is about and we can make a comment as well on a portfolio. We do have a contact us page as well. In this contact us, we have a form which will be submitted and basically, a, you know, some, some data here. We also have a request a quote. In here, you request a quote. This will say so if I select any sections, this is this is going to give me accordingly to what is available and it's going to calculate the price accordingly to that. Okay, and we have a hero image here and the footer. So this is the site that we are going to develop. And to achieve this, we have to obviously start from scratch and build the site, obviously from scratch. So without further ado, I think I will now get started with you guys. And please go to the next lecture. And in the next lecture, we are going to look how to prepare our environment. Before I end this lecture, I want you to also know that you do not need to have any technical background of any any coding, because in this in this um, course, I will try my best and do as minimal coding as possible, so that you can build a website without being. A